town of Antrax sits on the western peninsula of Mallorca and is the last main town on the southwest coast. To be honest, there isn't a huge amount in the town itself. An old church and a rather impressive gentleman building are really the only two buildings that stand out. Although there aren't any great shops or interesting old buildings on Antrax, there is one thing that makes a trip here worthwhile. The Centre for Contemporary Arts, or CCA, is one of the best art galleries on the island, and if you're a fan of modern art, it's well worth a visit. Aside from the CCA, there isn't too much to see in Antrax, but just two miles down the road, you do have Port Antrax. Port Andrax is still used as a fishing port, and you can watch the working boats come and go from the harbour, as well as the fishermen mending their nets. The waterfront on the southern side of the bay is lined with restaurants and cafes. We particularly like the Trianon restaurant, which is just towards the end of the bay. If you want to stay in Port Dandrex, then the Villa Italia offers some beautiful suites and great views of the port and surrounding hills. Although you can swim in the waters around Port Dandrex and there are a few bays here, there are much more interesting and beautiful beaches just a stone's throw away. Just around the coast is Kaya Yam, which is without doubt one of my favourite beaches on the island. Kayam is a beautiful cove surrounded by high cliffs formed by the end of the Tramontana Mountains. Although there's no sand here, you can make use of the Grand Follies Beach Club, which is a bar, restaurant, sun lounges and a pool. As well as beautiful beaches and modern art galleries, in and around the Andrax area there are also a number of tennis clubs and golf courses. Andrax actually has its own golf course, an 18-hole championship course designed by Glen Eagles of Scotland that is regarded as one of the most challenging on the island. A little outside of Andrax is Pagera, and here you'll find the Tennis Academy of Mallorca, home to 15 clay courts and professional coaching. If wildlife and nature appeals more than sport and exercise, then the wildlife reserve of Sadragonera, which is just off the southwest coast of Mallorca, will make a perfect day out. The town of Andrax itself isn't that interesting, but it's an excellent place to base yourself. Just around the corner you've got the CCA, and down the road you've got Sadragonera, Calle Yamp, and of course Port Dandrax. In the area as well, you'll also find excellent tennis clubs and golf courses. Andrax really is an ideal place to base yourself if you want to explore all that Mallorca has to offer.